September, an office of Aradis Yarua, in liaison with the regional police of West Nile, thought it wise that it's important to call the presser to communicate to members of the public following the case of involving the health safety chairperson for Bura sub county and one lady called Vivian Apollot. This is after a young girl, Akwe Deborah, registered a complaint with police that her baby had gone missing. Uh, we followed that and found that, okay, the kid had seemed passed on and buried. By the time of burial, Apollo Vivian and the chairman L63 had insisted that the child was theirs. Later on, Saturday evening, they came up and the wife confessed that the child that was buried is not her biological child and the child of her biological daughter called her queen Deborah. And I'm glad Deborah is here. She's the father. She's the mother of the, she's the complainant in the case and she's the mother of the baby. So, Chairman LC3 is under detention at Bura Police Headquarters, but for, wanted to be sure that they are very safe, they are kept at the CPS in Arua. So the purpose of this press is to basically explain to the public who is our chairman, who is the mother, what case exactly are we investigating, and what steps are to follow. But you know, my work is just to ensure that the, the process is free and fair, and that the public is informed of every step that the police is doing. I want to be very clear here, Aradis is not a complainant. I'm not even the judge, because clearly I'm not a judge. Government is supposed to ensure that the citizens get fairness and justice in everything that happens. So in this case, when an 18-year-old 18 girl comes and says, my baby has been buried without my knowledge in a place that I don't know, not in my mother's home, not in my mother's home, Office of RDC is mandated to ensure that this girl gets justice. One, should she, should she wish to have this child given to her? It must be done after uh, following all the legal steps. So I have the PRO, West Nile, here. She will then take over from here, and then we shall continue.